go down inside the Rio Goku Kokuki Gun in Tokyo, Japan. The one championship, a new era, was the biggest night in martial arts history. Michael Chevallo, Mitch Chilson with you. Mitch, it kicked off with Yotsen fight Highway Fairtex getting his revenge after 11 years on Andy Sauer. It was absolutely brilliant. We saw Yotsen Klein absolutely dominate Sauer and score a big knockout, and Sauer was unable to answer the bell. We said not to sleep on Timofei Nestukin. He came out and shocked all and sundry with a first round TKO of Eddie Alvarez. Timofei Nastukin absolutely shocked the world. You cannot sleep on Nastukin or Nastukin will put you to sleep. And that's what happened to the underground king, Eddie Alvarez. Yuya Wakamatsu put up a fantastic first round, but it wasn't enough against the greatest of all time, Demetrius Johnson. DJ showed why he is the very best in the world. He put on a clinic, but Yuya Wakamatsu was in there until the very end, until the unorthodox guillotine came to finish his night. Ong Lan Sun promised he'd knock out Ken Hasegawa quickly, and he did just that, a second round KO to retain the middleweight strap. Two KOs back to back for the rematch for Ung La Unsung. He was able to find a home for that right hand after piecing up the body of Ken Hasegawa. What an amazing performance for Ung La Unsung. And how about John Jin Nan retaining the women's strawweight strap, defeating Angela Lee with a fifth round KO? The first woman to stop unstoppable. Zhong Jingnan looks spectacular. The game plan came to fruition. She may have kept it close to the chest the entire time, but she was able to capitalize on her moment and defend her one strawweight world title. And the main event, the recreation, the revolution of Shinya Aoki is complete. A first round finish to recapture the lightweight crown. Shinya Aoki found another level in his story career he was able to slap on an arm triangle choke and you either tap or you're gonna take a nap folks will join you on april 12 live from the mall of asia arena in manila with two world title bouts